Hi. Hello, 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 everybody. How you doing? This is Color and Chat with Joanna, and I am Joanna. Welcome to the channel. I hope everybody's having a good day. I hope you're not too depressed after watching the longest funeral in the history of the world. I guess if you have a job for 71 years, you deserve a long funeral. But, you know, what about, what about Chuck? You know, like, Poor Charlie Bucket. <laughs> I'm kind of thinking about uh, King Charles III, like Charlie Bucket, because he can't get a pen to work. <laughs> There's this whole thing on YouTube about him not being able to get a pen to work, and it's pitiful. Anyway, I am not here to talk about Charlie Bucket. <clears throat> oh, but some things are going to change. He really... I Can you imagine... Like, the money you have will have no more value because it has to have his name on it and not his mother's. This is a weird situation for us. Um, us Americans don't get it. We just say, put it on my card. Okay, well, <clears throat> while I was saying, put it on my card, dun -dun -dun -dun, I decided to have a little unboxing. Which, by the way, I did two-thirds of the unboxing and realized I didn't have the damn camera on. How many times have I done this? Like, a lot, right? Okay, she's huge. This is not, like, one hot mess. Who is light and fun and small? This is Steampunk Prowess. And let me tell you something. If you are going big... Or going home, this is your girl. Do not come to play with this. There's nothing easy about it. Um, I looked at the box and I kind of freaked out a little bit because I was like, holy crap, this box weighs like 30 pounds, you know? And then I realized the drills, oh, it's like a, a never ending cup of coffee. <laughs> Like, we are going to drink so much coffee trying to get this to be completed because it is... Hold on a minute. There's going to be a little banging. I'm so sorry. I'm trying to be here. Okay. There we go. Um, yeah. How now, brown cow? I mean, this is like every shade of brown in the world and black. And gold and then there's this tiny little bit of pink in here which I think they might have for her skin tone but anyway she's a monster would you like to see her I already have out um, uh, my my poor sweet <laughs> my my mask of love I'm still working on her it's going a lot slower than I hoped but you know I got a lot going on right now and things happen when you get busy and you can only do so much. I mean, you can't go around beating yourself up about it. Okay, she's incredible. I'm going to have to do it in two parts because it's just, I mean, look, look. You can't even, here we go. That is the main part. Things are going to get knocked around now, watch. <laughs> Sorry. Um, this is just the main part of the diamond painting. Uh, but I wanted to get you to see her face. And I think she's got a socket wrench. Um, let me turn down this light a little bit. Kind of glaring on things. Here we go. Now you can see her better. Um, okay. Now we're going to go section by section because she's just this is like I could wallpaper the wall with this thing um this is called steampunk prowless and she ain't she ain't coming to play I mean this is serious business uh Chris Ortega is the artist and uh we should take a moment and look at the sheet you know I can't wait to put this in my in my lookbook right because the um Come on down a little bit. Let's just get a little closer so you can see all the detail because this is easier to see in the detail than the way that this is charted. And I'm not sure if, look at, I don't know what that is. 
Hmm. She have beauty mark? <laughs> maybe maybe we'll have to give her one. Um <clears throat> Relax, it'll 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 focus for you. Okay. Chris Ortega is all about the details. I mean, we are just way too serious. And this thing is like for I mean, literally, like I nothing is gonna get done for like a month. <laughs> I'll probably start it in January and just, it'll be a great Christmas is over. Let's start something big. Um, I definitely do not recommend this to a newbie. If you are a newbie in diamond painting, um, buy it because I think she's beautiful. And if you think she's beautiful, then you can buy it and put it in your closet and then wait like about a year when you really get you know into a rhythm and when you you have to have nothing else on your plate this can't be a whipping chat that you know well I'm working on this I'm working on this and this thing is I mean all consuming huge huge of oh, the clock and everything okay she is a square and she is 20, 27 inches by 37 inches or 68 centimeters by 96 centimeters. I just can't. I really am a glutton for punishment. I, I don't know why. I, I got to go big all the time. I just don't see them that way until they're in my face. Um, she's massive. She has 65 colors and she has two AB diamonds. Uh, the, the ABs are going to be very subtle. Um, they're sort of like a, like right around in here in the clock. Um, there, it's like a, there's like a sage green, very pale sage green, and I think there may be some highlights in the in the, her dress, which we'll move down to as a second part in a moment. Um, and then there's like a buttery gold color, uh, a very pale. But it, it's just a weird color. I've never, I don't know. I'll tell you when I get there. And if I really, <laughs> please accept my apologies right now for not going through these because there's 65 colors, A, <laughs> number one. <laughs> and, oh yeah, did I mention it this way is like 38 pounds? No way. No, I'm not opening the bag. I'll never get it back in the bag. I'll never, it can't be done. Not by me. Not at my skill level. Um, I'll be throwing stuff across the room, yelling and screaming and causing all kinds. Of, I, I, I will go like Charlie Bucket, get me a pen. Anyway, <laughs> so, um, okay. What can we say about her? Um, the details are incredible. It is confetti heaven if you're a confetti person and you like the confetti and the highlights and everything definitely go for it i kind of feel like she needs to have a name and i think we need to name her because she's so beautiful and so unique you know she reminds me of randy you know uh, you can call me butter and randy does assessments on these big diamond paintings she can look at the colors and she can lay out a color chart so if you do want help or support and you really want to bang it out give her a call because i may give her a call who knows i i have my ideas about it but i may be in over my head i don't know i don't know she's just not lighthearted, and she's not for it she's serious really really serious um her robot is all made up of all of her hoardy situation over here going on she has this incredible green bustier she's had the boob job by the best doctor ever and look at the little flower there's this beautiful orange flower that i think i would like to do in sparklers or something really really bright okay let me try to pull her back for you a little bit. I, I don't, I'm really sorry. She's just too big and long-suffering husband isn't feeling his best today. So I'm just kind of 
letting him alone and letting him rest it out. Let's see. Because, uh, you know, he can't be all things to all people all the time. This is her fabulous. Her gown, her, her dress is great. I mean, it, now I went through a whole steampunky kind of moment. And I got to tell you, I love steampunk people. If you're a steampunker, give me a call and say hi or, or, or give me a comment. Drop a comment. Drop a drop a wrench <laughs> on the emojis. Do, do something steampunky because you guys are crazy and I love it. I cannot get enough of it. The tools and the, the resources that they use are so incredible and you would think that people spend fortune but they don't that's the whole thing about real steampunkers and uh people like like i think of tim holt sometimes that he's kind of a steampunker in the dark in the quiet you know but he's a maker he's always making stuff he has to be inspired to make things all the time. And then, of course, right here at the bottom are her thighs. Hey, girl, hey. <laughs> it's covered, though. This is all, this is this has fabric and covering on it. Um, it's just so much easier to see this on the photograph because the rendering is really, really dark. And you are going to, I'm already, I, now I do, I see that there's rendering and everything, but I don't hear. Oh, not the light now. <laughs> this light, I don't know. I think I have a short in it or something. I really do. Because there's times when it'll go on and off, and I never know if it can come or go. But we still have the other light to work with. Anyway, um, you're gonna you're gonna be challenged by this this is a real challenge and i would definitely not do a poster frame i would do a go to your goodwill and take the measurements you know if if it has to be a little wider let it be a little wider you can always paint this black or you can put pretty washi tape on it or you know if it has to be a little smaller then then cut it Girl needs a haircut sometimes. What are you going to do? I mean, really, if it saves you $300 going to a framing shop. But, um, yeah, you're going to want to take your time with this one because she's a lot, a lot, a lot of work. Um, what do I see in the way of drills? I see... I'm scared. I... I want to open it. It's too big and dark and hairy i mean look at that god what a ton i mean i can't there's only two ab's but i don't see them do you see them anywhere let me see if we can find them yeah see i didn't see them but i do see some really these beautiful olive greens are incredible and I'm just really afraid that if I if I open this and let her out of the cage, I know she won't go back in. So, uh, you got it. This is where we're at. Okay, so I wanted to let you know also that we're going to start doing whip and checks a lot more often. Um, I was doing them four or five days at a time before I moved. And then I moved and you know what happens when you move chaos hello you know and, and um i don't think i'm gonna do that so i'm going to uh you know i just wanted to get organized and get unpacked and settled so many things come into play when you move you gotta find a new doctor then you have to find the specialist that they send you to and then you gotta you gotta find out where the grocery stores are and add all the little things, you know, before you really feel like you're here. And change your driver's license. Oh, that's a joke. Um, anyway, so we have a lot to do. But and I feel like, you know, I, I let go so much of so much furniture. I really, I, I really did. I let go of so much crap that I really don't have as much storage. 
So um, I'm kind of rebuilding from the ground up. The apartment so far is looking lovely. It has good sides and bad sides, you know. There are days when I love it and days when I'm like, oh, crap, what have I done? But, um, you know, I, I love the facilities and the, the um, having your own workout gym. Oh, my God. And the pool. It's just too much. It's so beautiful. Um, but it's only like 74 degrees. So <laughs> that might be a little cool for some pool people. Me? I'd be in it right now. Um, anyway, I hope you enjoyed her. But I tell you, she is big. She is not cheap. Uh, she, you, you need to get your points and your um, coupons and scrape everybody together for this one because she's like 80 something dollars so she's not cheap she's not light-hearted there's nothing easy about this painting that i can see right now but i know once i get started and i get in the rhythm of her and i don't have anything else to do oh we are gonna jam out because i love not like love steampunk and I hope you do too. So please remember that you are important to me. That makes you got to be important to you. Um, and take care of you, okay? And, uh, you know, go take a look at her. She's incredible. I love her and I hope that you do too. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Have a good, good, good day. And uh, don't forget to shine on, okay? Shine big. Okay. Love you. Bye, guys. Thank you.